Hey, man, did you hear about that uh, famous comedian, Whitney Cummings, that got in trouble for saying Merry Christmas to an intern? Wait, what? For for just saying Merry Christmas? What, what? Why would she get in trouble for saying that? It's the craziest thing, but... Wait, well, before I do that, let me just explain to, to the people watching this who Whitney Cummings is. Because I know she's not super famous, and people in China might not even know who she is. But basically, she's a comedian, she's an actress, and she's a producer. And she created that famous TV show, Two Broke Girls. I, I don't know if that's famous in China, but in the U.S., it was famous. It was on TV for like seven, eight years or something. Yeah, I've heard of it. Like that, yeah. Well, basically what happened is um, Whitney was going home after finishing uh, a day on the set. And as she was leaving, she said, Merry Christmas to an intern. And okay, of course, no big deal, right? You're just saying Merry Christmas. That's super normal. But when she came back to work the next day, Human Resources called her into the office and they were like, oh, you were you were reported by uh, an intern. And she's like, oh, what did I do? And she said that the HR, Human Resources, said to her that the intern reported her for saying Merry Christmas. And she was like, oh, wait, why did he do that? What does he celebrate? You know, what's his deal? And they said, oh, he doesn't celebrate any of that stuff. He's agnostic, and he felt offended by the fact that you wished him a Merry Christmas. What is an agnostic exactly? Like, is it is is it similar to an atheist? Because I know I know an atheist is someone who does not believe in any god. Well, basically, an agnostic is somebody who claims they don't have true knowledge of God. And they claim, well, they, don't, they never say that God doesn't exist, right? So that's what separates them from the atheist. The atheist will deny that God exists, 100%. And agnostic says, we just don't have enough knowledge to like, you know, we don't have, as humans, we don't have enough like knowledge to know that, that God exists. So an agnostic is someone who, is someone who believes that, it is not humanly possible to prove or disprove the existence of God. Am I understanding it correctly? Or? Yeah, that sounds about right. And, but, you know, it, it really isn't that important because, I, I mean, I, I'm just shocked that, that anybody would do this. And why would anybody do this? I, I, it's, so, it's so crazy to me. I just can't believe it. Yeah, I don't. I don't believe that Whitney Cummings was trying to offend anybody because saying "Merry Christmas" is is as common as someone saying "Hello." Yeah, it, it's it's absolutely insane that this intern he expected that this celebrity should know his religion before she even ever talks to him, and I mean it's very unlikely that she ever did talk to him because. He's just an intern. He's, he's he's at the bottom of the totem pole when it comes to the workplace. You know, his job is only to get coffee and food for the writers and the actors. You know, they don't exactly become friends with the celebrities. Yeah, I think I think it's ridiculous a story like this. And and we're we actually seeing more and more stories like this in America. It's so annoying. It's terrible. I I, I think the young people these days are just way, way too sensitive. Way too sensitive. Yeah, I think. I don't. I don't even think the intern was even that offended. Like, I think he probably just wanted wanted attention. Yeah, you know, maybe maybe he was just jealous of how successful she is. You know, who knows why he did it? We'll never know why. But if it was, if if this was my TV show. I would fire this kid because being an intern is a privilege. It's not a right. And it's such a rare opportunity for someone to have. And this kid is just causing problems for no reason whatsoever. You know, if someone says to you, Merry Christmas while passing by, you know, they didn't mean to offend you. Like I said, she doesn't even know your religion. So, you know? Yeah. Yeah. This, this kid has no idea how good he has it in life. Like many people would would 
would love to work on a, on a TV show. I think you're just starting problems for for no reason. I 100% agree with you, and I think a lot of the people in China are going to be shocked that this is even a story because it's 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 so crazy. But this this is actually something that's happening in the United States m- more and more with the young generation. But keep in mind, it's a young generation. The older generation isn't so much like this. It's just the young people are finding any reason to be offended and to be mad. It's it's absolutely ridiculous. And I I, I don't know. I, 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 we should just stop talking about this. It it, it just annoys me. Does, yeah. Doesn't it annoy you? Yeah, it does. It, it like it has it has become. It actually has become a trend to to get to get offended easily, to to be to be so sensitive about about these little things. 